we are going to look at the vaccination schedule uh, in GOAT. Uh, we are going to categorize diseases and also the time in which the vaccines are being uh, administered to the, to the animal. We are going to start with anthrax. Anthrax is a, bacteri is a bacterial disease and the vaccine is, a, is given to the animal or to the young one six months after birth and it is done annually. Done every year, one time. The other one is hemorrhagic septicemia, which is the, 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 to the toxins or, and the blood. So for this one is administered uh, six months after birth for a kid and it's repeated annually. The other one is enterotoxemia. Uh, the, key, the kid is uh, given the vaccine four months after birth annually and 15 days later this uh, vaccine can be boosted and if the mother to the kid was not vaccinated the kid is vaccinated the first week after birth. The other one, the other one is black water. Black water is also a, 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 a bacterial disease, very, very, very bad disease. So it's almost close to anthrax. So the, uh, the vaccine is administered six months for the kid after birth and it is done annually. Foot and mouth disease, we say there's a viral disease. Four months after birth, the kid is given the vaccine and this one is done twice in a year. The other one is the goat pox. The goat pox, not common disease, is done three months and above for a kid. And there is repeated after every one year. The other one is contagious caprine pneumonia or CCPP. The vaccine is administered to the kid three months for three months and above for the kid and is repeated annually. The other one is the goat plague or PPR, pestidus petit ruminans. This one is given to a kid three months old and in is given after every three years. So after every three years, this particular vaccine is administered. Now, uh, these vaccines can be repeated based on the need. If there is an outbreak, it, the, the, the vaccine can be repeated and the vaccination uh, varies from one region to the other, depending on the need. So for our schedule here, it's not a standard uh, schedule, but they're just a guideline on what is supposed to be done. But if the need is required for the vaccination to be done, uh, uh, the, vaccine, the vaccine can be administered to the, to the goats. And since the, the disease varies from one region to the other, it is important for the farmer to understand the common diseases within his locality, to know which disease need to be, uh, to be prevented through vaccination and this can be uh, guided by the qualified practitioner within the area uh, to know which disease uh, are common in that area and which vaccine that need to be, to be administered when uh, to ensure that uh, the animals are not infected by these uh, uh, diseases. So not all these diseases are, are common and therefore it's important for the farmer to know which disease affect the animal within that re region or which uh, strain of the, of, the, of the disease is prevalent in a given uh, location.